Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. We're gonna do a little night in my life. Monday, oh my god. It is a Monday, um, it is February. It's Monday, February like 6th. Um, and we're gonna do a little night in my life. It's like four o'clock. I kind of worked all day. I went on like a run. I ran six and a half miles today, guys. Um, but I want to show you guys like a little night routine because, yeah, I'm doing laundry currently and jamming to some music. And yeah, so it's kind of fun, low key. Because it's like my favorite time of day is like golden at like 4 or 4.30 when the sun's starting to set. It's like golden hour. But like it like shines into my room. And it's just like good vibes and I love it. So I was like, I want to pull the camera and vlog. I look like a disaster because I literally ran and I haven't like showered or anything. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna put on my laundry away. We have a lot. I've been putting it off. And then I have a load going in the in the dryer right now. So I'm gonna wait to put all this away until that's done. But I'm gonna like organize it so I can't stay in my bed. It'll be on my bed until I do it, but yeah. Okay guys, my Princess Polly package came in for the month. Um, I'm doing like a collab with them or whatever. Um, super cool still. Like that's like still amazing to me because I used to shop that. I do shop that all the time. So it's awesome. But this top is like so fun and different. Like it has like two little straps and then like the sleeves. And I got like crazy traps. So I was like nervous about it. But I kind of like it. Um, but I clearly have a very distinct colorway if you cannot tell. I'm into the, I'm into the grays, blues, and greens. And black. But the purses, oh my god, I'm so excited. This is the best haul, honestly, I think I've gotten in so long. Um, I'm loving everything. And then here's like a little green top. It's literally just a plain green top. And then I got this black leather la blazer to wear with something. On the on something I had girls wearing with those little like Aritzia rompers or like something similar to that. And obviously I love those. So I feel like that's kind of what I'd pair it with. But it'd be kind of cute with something like this too. So, I've never gotten like a black leather blazer, so I'm really excited because I've always wanted one. I've never gotten one. Yeah. And then wait, there's one, there's a few more things. These purses are literally everything. This one's like a, like a scratchy but puffy thing. This would be, this is going to be like my go-to little just like throw on running errands when I'm in like active wear, you know. But then look at these gems. Oh my god, this green one, this green little leather one. Every, it's everything. It's literally my, it's so adorable. And then I got this little leather brown one because I'm like... I, now I kind of have all the bases covered with the colors. I think it's so pretty. This shape is like one of my favorite shapes of purses right now too. So, oh my god, I'm, I literally love it all. I love it all. And then I got this dress, but I really don't want to try it on. It's essentially, oh, I got this t-shirt too. I didn't try this on. So this is just a gray like long sleeve. It's like that material. And then I got the exact same thing in the long sleeve dress. Actually, this would be cute with the blazer. Maybe I'll try it on for you guys. <laughs> So here's the dress. This is really cute. Like, it's so simple. But, like, I feel like I could definitely wear this, like, a million different ways. Because it's so basic, but it's so comfortable. I wish I would have, like, gotten ready today and, like, maybe did my hair or makeup or some sort. Because I'm, like, literally looking so rough for this try-on. But this wasn't really the point of the vlog at all. So, like, this is just happened to come in today. And I want to show you guys because I'm excited. Okay, the colors aren't really giving what I wanted to give, but the length is everything. Like I might say, I could still wear it. Mm, probably not. That's kind of, a, I love it. Cuties, I love it. I'm really branching out on my style. Like I feel like recently in the past like couple months, I've really like honed in on finding my own style, which I think is cool because honestly before I used to just like, I don't know, I just, I like, oh my God, that is not good. My hair should not be falling out like that. Anyway, um, I feel like in the past, like, I've always, like, liked my style. But I'm really, like, finding, like, clothing that I think complements my body. The colorways that complement my body. Like, colorways that I like. I'm finding more, like, simple, basic pieces that I can, like, wear forever. Like, I hate. I, if you guys can't tell, I rarely buy just, like, cute little tops. And I don't buy, like, those going out tops and stuff because I don't go out. Clothes, I literally can wear for, like, ever. Like, they're all, like, the ones I wear actually wear in my closet or just like my basics my go-to everyday pieces and i love them because i can kind of re-wear them in like a million different ways so i'm excited and so for real right now you guys i'm exhausted and like want to go to bed <laughs> i think that six and a half miles just really took it out of me today honestly and getting up at 4 30 and i'm just tired and my laundry's still going so we're gonna go to target it's only 5 30 
tomorrow the thing is today like i kind of like chunk my days into like content days and like editing and work days and today was more of like an editing work day and then tomorrow's my content day because i'm getting my lashes in i'm gonna self tan tonight i'm gonna feel cute tomorrow i don't feel cute today so i need to get out of the house honestly that's the main reason we're doing this is because i I don't leave my house other than my runs or the gym so we're gonna go adventure and do that and then i want to bring my new little purse if you see me at target today i'm just gonna apologize because i looked I, it's kind of a cute outfit if like this was giving a little more i do kind of need a little snack though oh, i want more grapes i thought it was out do i run to sam's club and get grapes too that's like a lot of work I feel like i might do it buy it Oh, I wish Sam's Club had these. These are fantastic. They're so fire. Hopefully, this would be the process by the time we get home. Probably won't be, but we're going to try. So I need to prep some. I was going to do that today. I was supposed to prep food. Maybe I'll get some like, defrosted ground turkey. Whoa, I was not expecting the camera to be able to see me in the dark. It's like dark and cloudy. Like there was no sunset and it's like, mm, the weather took a, it was so nice out earlier though. I guess it is what it is, right? <laughs> oh my God, I feel like I'm always here and on a vlog. Like what am I not grocery shopping? This is like, I feel better though. I was listening to some music. I was like, y'all. Listening to some music. I'm really into a country right now. I'm really into country music right now. So kind of got like vibey on the way here. So I'm gonna do this quick. I'm gonna, I think I need... I'm gonna see if they have simple mills, any like the things that I like here. Grapes. I think I'm gonna try to get in and out. I think that's it. I think that's what we're gonna get. Just probably grapes. So that was cool. This guy looks it's taking a lot out of me not to get these because who remembers this phase? Like, I would literally eat a bag of these a week. Oh my god, I want them so bad. But I'll eat the whole bag. That's the thing. I have no self control. So I got grapes and these things and turkey. And that's it. I'm gonna go. But I'm gonna go to Target and at Target I do want to get like I saw something on TikTok of this girl and it was like her day in the life She was like organizing her desk or something like that I don't even know some sort of some vlog and she had like a little like organizer for her receipts for her like taxes And I'm like I need that so I want to find something like that cottage cheese and coffee That's what we're going to Target for um and yeah, but I got my grapes. I'm so excited. Guys, and now we're back at Target. Literally, who surprised mommy? I, I definitely just walked past like two high school boys in their car doing that. So we're just gonna keep walking like that. <laughs> Didn't just happen. Why do high schoolers like intimidate me? Like that's not right. Cause they have like random journals. They don't have a lot. It's like so picked up. Notebooks, journals, these. I don't really know what that is. Or there's this, which is kind of cute. I kind of like this. I feel like they fit in here. It's so disorganized, it's stressing me out. Hmm. Oh, here's more stuff. Maybe I'll find something. See, I don't think so. I need something like closed. Okay, so this thing's literally massive, but I can organize it by the month and I think that would be easy. So I'm gonna get it. Wait, but this one's way cuter, but I don't know how much it is. I feel like I kind of want this one. I think I'm gonna get this one actually because I could set this next to my desk and it'd be decorative. I'll give you guys a little Target haul. Um, these are from Sam's, but let's eat them because they're so yummy. I got two of the cold brews so I don't have to go to Target again because I go through those quite quickly. This is my third one of these. Um, it's like the little like sink scrubbers, but mine went down the garbage disposal and it's just disgusting and needs to be thrown away. There's probably so much bacteria on that. So. I just got, they only had one of these. I was going to get two, but I got the good culture cottage cheese. And then I ended up getting this. It was only 16. I think it was like 40 um, for like my documents. And I can organize it month to month, which I'm excited about. Aha. Because I have so many receipts. And if I have any other like important documents, I'll just put it in there. So I don't have anything to like store that kind of stuff. And essentially I'm like my own office. So yeah, at seven, really not that late. It feels so late. But I kind of do want to wrap that. Kind of sounds good. I made one on Saturday and it was really good. You guys, this stuff from Trader Joe's, this holiday vegetable hash is like my holy grail right now. I'm going to be so sad if they stop selling it because it's so good. It's like sweet potato squash, sage, not parsley. Oh yeah, parsley, sage, rosemary, celery, red onions, 
potato and butternut squash and it smells amazing it cooks up i throw it with so many different things because like you can put it with like soups and stuff i put it with my eggs usually but i'm gonna put it with my wrap today to like give it a little something <laughs> Me trying to like weigh these down so they can see her. And I'm watching a movie, so if you hear that, I'm sorry. But I see something going on right now. <laughs> You guys, look how fire those look. Genuinely, like those look so amazing. And they're like good and crispy. Okay, they didn't sound crispy, but they are. Y'all, not me thinking this movie's gonna be funny. Melissa McCarthy's in it. It's literally about her having like a miscarriage and her like marriage going so over. So now I'm gonna cry. So <laughs> I ate those so fast and so good. And for dessert, I'm gonna be eating some of these caramel rice cakes and dipping it in some Greek yogurt. Cause we like a balance of all those are a little protein, a little carb. And then I'm gonna go self tan and go to bed. But I'm gonna watch a little bit of this movie because it's quite good. But I'm telling you, I dip everything in Greek yogurt. Pretty good. Not even gonna lie. It'd be better if it mixed like protein powder in it and made it more of like a dip. But I already had two servings of that today, so I'm just gonna do the Greek yogurt. Okay, guys, I decided to try out this like. And a butter I got yesterday from Campus Protein. It's cinnamon swirl crunch. It's like a peanut butter protein. It has actually has like a lot of protein in it. Look at this. I'm onto something. That's really freaking fire. That's really good. Oh my god. Okay, I just washed my body. My hair is disgusting. I know it's like flat because I wear the headband. But um, I'm washing it tomorrow because I'm doing a hit of five with Everett. And then I have a lash appointment. Um, so I'm going to like do a full shower before that lash appointment. But you guys, I feel so weird in a towel on YouTube. Which people do it all the time. And I'm always like, I don't know if I could do that. And I'm doing it right now. So I don't really know why. Well, I'm, I do know why. It's because I uh, don't want to go put clothes on right now. And I wanted to film this. My skin feels dry, but um, I was gonna self tan tonight, you guys know. But then I was like, you know what? I'm kind of feeling the paleness. Like I'm kind of into the paleness, and I want to see how long I can vibe with that and just not be self tanned. Will that last? Maybe until tomorrow? Yeah, possibly. But I also saw like people take self tan and they put on makeup brushes and they apply it kind of like a um, contour. I'm like, maybe I could try that. So we'll see, but I don't want to self-tan. And I'm really just kind of want to go to bed. So. Okay, I'm deciding to be responsible and I'm going to finish my laundry that was in the dryer because I put all the other, this is all my Princess Polly stuff and then some stuff I have to shoot with. So that's not laundry I have to put away right now. It actually needs to be out so I remember to, to, to put it on and take pictures in it. Um, but I put all the other, other laundry away earlier but I still have stuff in the dryer so I'm going to go get that, put that away and then I'm going to lay in bed and I'm going to write out a workout for my app because I've been a lot better the past two weeks um, about like staying up with it like day to day rather than doing it all on Sunday. <laughs> but and it's been a lifesaver because my Sundays I have open now. So I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to write out some of the hit workout that I'm going to do with Everett to be prepped for tomorrow and set out my workout outfit. Then I'm going to get out of the dryer probably. And yeah. And this is a TLF hoodie that I'm obsessed with you guys. Like, look how, it's so cute. Like, I love the shade, like, I love the shade of it. Like, this is my favorite, like, shade of gray. And I love the hoodie that it doesn't have the strings. Like, this is my ideal hoodie. I love it. And then I'm just wearing my white skims, boyfriend shorts that I wear in black, gray, or brown every single night, so. And I'm going to finish watching that movie on Netflix. Well, probably not finish it, but I'm going to put it on while I do my laundry because I like a little entertainment, you know? Okay, guys, now I need to put all this away. Like, how do I have that many sweatshirts? Like, what? Guys, it's already 9.45. I need to be asleep like 10 minutes ago, so I'm just gonna go to bed. 
and do my workout program tomorrow because sleep is important. Catch you in the morning. Rise and shine. It is 4.41 in the morning. I'm going to the gym to work out ever. It's Tuesday. Y'all know the vibes. I had a really scary dream last night that two people broke into my apartment. And you know how I scared them off? With a spoon. That was my dream. And now I'm just on an edge a little bit. Because that scared me. But anyway. Let me get a little energy drink. This is bad, you guys. I'm kind of back in a Celsius phase because, well, how could you not be when they're just staring at you? You know what I'm saying? And I'm really into my strawberry guava. But, like, look how satisfying it is, you guys. I organized it. Love, laugh, love. But, you guys, Everett and I have been working out, like, one to two times together every single week doing hit, and I'm loving it. Um, and I'm not technically, you know how I tell you guys how I'm trying to, like, cycle my workouts together? But you see, I'm running into a bit of an issue. Because I thought I was supposed to get it yesterday. And, like, I haven't felt a difference in, like, I, I think all my stuff's so messed up because I don't feel tired. Like my body doesn't know. That's it. I don't know if like, I feel tired from like my hormone cycling or if it's like I'm literally training for half marathon so I'm out there running a lot more than I used to. Like I never know how my body's really feeling and like it's obviously off my 28 days. So I'm like I don't know what this is really doing. But the seat thing was supposed to help. So I'm like I'm gonna go do it I guess. Cause that's what I enjoy doing. I don't know, I just go with the flow. I don't think I'm gonna take you guys like through my workout today just because I have a lash appointment at nine and so I kinda have to hustle. And I've been vlogging like all of our workouts. So it's like, do I do that again? I'll bring you guys. I don't know if I'll vlog it. Like, do you guys wanna keep seeing them? You know, I don't know. Let me know. You guys ain't ever just did a workout. How do you feel? Good. We, just, got that cocoa <laughs> we just stretched you guys. There was these two girls, Tatum and um what was the other girl? Tatum and Jaden. Jaden. We're doing the splits and stuff. So me and Everett tried. We're ready. <laughs> Everett can literally drop it lower than me. I'm not kidding. <laughs> but it's only look at that, yeah, look at that. <laughs> it's seven. The new Taylor. <laughs> new Taylor, Taylor, Taylor 2.0, he's coming for you. <laughs> oh my god, my legs are so bad though. Like, we, I can't do the stairs. I was gonna, but I'm not. I'm just gonna go home and eat. My stomach's growling the whole workout. Yeah. But. Are you gonna do stairs or sprints around a lot? <laughs> <laughs> Neither. <laughs> Imagine. Let's go. Oh Whoa. my god, I need to go eat it's so bad. Our <laughs> phone. Showered, washed my hair, so it's like fresh and clean. I'm making breakfast because I'm like so hungry. Like the whole workout, my stomach was growling. Usually, I'm never hungry before a workout. Like I was shocked, and I'm wearing this top from Princess. I don't know how I feel about it right now. I might change because we'll see. If you haven't caught on. This is my new current hyperfixation breakfast. So it's Greek yogurt. Oh, brown sugar, oatmeal, protein powder. I thought I used the peanut butter one, but okay. And then mangoes, blueberries, flax pumpkin and cinnamon and a drizzle of honey on top and it's so good okay i just changed i put this shirt on instead i just was feeling it more um but it's 8 40 my appointment's at 9 so i'm gonna get going so i'm not late um i just posted my workout on instagram i'm like tired that like made me tired sitting down i journaled and then did that because like my morning routine's like obviously different on days i just get up and go to the gym so i journaled and I didn't wake up. I have to have a little coffee today. My body's tired though. Like I feel like I've just been go, go, go. So I need to be a little chiller with it maybe. So today is gonna be, I think, a content focused day. Um, I should have wrote out my to-do list, but I'll do that one after my appointment. Kind of brainstorm it while she's doing my lashes what I need to do. Maybe in the car before I go in. But today's a big content day, I think. And I'm excited because these are my favorite days because obviously I get to like make the content um let me take some pictures make a tiktok make a recipe and then I need to stay up on emails and yeah there's a few things but and oh my gosh it's gonna be like 15 sunny later today so I think we should go on a walk I'm excited I'm really looking forward to it because it's like gloomy and like rainy this morning but then it's gonna clear up Okay, outfit of the day is this long sleeve, like I said, from Princess Polly. And then my TLF gray sweatpants. They're literally my favorite sweatpants ever. I wear them all the time. It's like ridiculous. And then my new balances because you guys, I told you I was going to hyperfix it over these shoes and wear them all the time. And I am, so.
Guys, I just got my lashes, my brows, and my lip wax. And I feel like a new person. Maddie's the best. And you guys, she got me a meditation fellow. I'm so excited. Lily, she's the best. Thank you. She's the cutest. <laughs> ah! Hi, guys. Okay, literally, I'm kind of feeling the hair. Like, the natural hair right now. It's so curly, but like a good curl. Anyway, I got my lip done. Like I said, my lashes, my brows. It feels so much better. I just needed that so bad. Um, But... It's 10. It's just almost 10. Um, so we're making good time today. Lash appointment, workout, all that in already. Um, I'm going to make a little coffee, just a little pick-me-up um, to sip on while I get some work started. But I think I'm having a good day. I'm like in a very good mood if you can't tell. I'm very happy. Maddie's the best, you guys. She literally got me a meditation pillow to sit on when I meditate. She's like so into that and she's literally amazing. And she... I love her. And she got me crystal. You guys, she's so sweet. Like, like when people like think of me in like senses like that, like, I don't know, it just means so much. Like, she, ah, I literally love her. My apartment is so cold downstairs. Upstairs is nice, toasty 70. Down here is literally 50. I'm not kidding, I'm so cold. But it's noon already. The day just goes by so fast. I'm gonna make lunch, prep some chicken because I didn't do any meal prep yesterday like I wanted to. Yeah, I'm gonna make eggs for lunch and then meal prep chicken and drink a coffee. But I can't even fathom drinking a coffee right now because I'm so cold. <sighs> but I want my cold brew because it just gets me going. I truthfully want a warm latte, but I can't. I need my cold brew. It's so good. Of course, we're drinking a wine glass out of a wine glass. Was that even a question? This would be so great. We did get it before 30 today. We do every day. <laughs> These two things again. Spinach and egg whites. I guess that was like my dinner last night, but I'm using egg whites instead of a wrap. But this stuff is just so good. Oh, I didn't finish making my coffee. Lifesaver, because I like my coffee sweet. Let's give it a little taste test. Amaze. Okay, she's made a big giant plate of egg whites with the scramble and turkey. And then we have to top it with, of course, <laughs> ketchup because you guys know me and eggs and ketchup. And then my other beloved Cholula hot sauce. This is the best hot sauce in my opinion. Um, okay, and then the cherry on top. Some salt. I literally add this flaky sea salt to everything. I just feel like you can taste it a lot more because it's like bigger flakes, maybe. I'm obsessed with it though. I can literally put it on everything. I like my stuff salty though. Like, look how yum. I really not ever gonna get sick of this. Well, I probably will, but hot. It's kind of funny because I feel like my meals, like my vlogs are like a week or two behind like real time when I upload them because I have so many like pre-filmed because I've been vlogging so much there's like my meals and my hyperfixations like change like the videos I upload I'm like oh my gosh I haven't eaten that in like two weeks so, like this I feel like when it goes live I'm gonna be like oh my gosh like I miss that like I haven't had that in two weeks mm -mm -mm. I did in fact bust out the chocolate covered espresso beans they're so good the texture the flavor they're amazing. Okay, guys, I'm currently shooting for this Princess Polly video. And I want to show you this fit. But like, I literally, behind the scenes, had to shove my entire bed. I'll show you. Okay, this is the fit. This is like the blue um, Lioness Miami Vice pants. I'm obsessed with this freaking color. It's my favorite color ever. I need to pause this music because I'm going to copyright it. Thing. 
That's the hardest thing about vlogging all the time for you guys is I always have music playing and I literally have to turn it off and it's always in the way. Um, and this purse is everything, but like, I'm gonna show you guys what's actually going on in this corner. Okay, so the lighting is really good right here, okay? So I am have my tripod up right in my door, but it's too cold obviously to put it outside, that'd be embarrassing. But I need like this right here. But I had to move my bed all the way this way so I could stand right here for the clip. <laughs> I even have my ring light on. But, like, literally, this is what I do, you guys. This is how I shoot. Oh, that's Snapchat. I literally have my camera open. Put it like this. Get it on the 16.9. Zoom it out. And record it. Boom. Outfit number two is this white shirt. Obsessed with it. Because um, look at the back. Like, you're kidding. I'm a freaking sucker for an open back. Like, it could roll down and be, like, full length. So, I feel like it could be more coverage, more professional looking. But I feel like I paired it with this brown purse. Um, and I feel like that could work. Or the black one, I think, could also work. But I have these pants in a tan color. And I think with the brown purse and the white in a tan, it could also be a moment. So, I think I'm going to throw those on. Because I got them in my last Princess Polly haul. So, I feel like that could be a vibe. Okay, but then look at this. My green purse with the tan pants and the white shirt. Like, that's really, really cute. But then so is the brown. Me having a sense of style recently. I don't know which one I like more. Oh, I think I'm, my freaking ice drinks in the way. Now we gotta do a top change. Y'all probably can't even see me because of the lighting, but I need to change my top. Honestly, I kind of like this bit. You literally, I'm sorry, the lighting is so bad. It's so good on my camera though. So bad on this camera. I just got done shooting all of that Princess Polly content and then kind of going through it of like what I liked. Um, and it's 3.20, my chicken's been sitting out so I should put that in the fridge. And then I'm gonna go on a hot girl walk, I think, because the sun is shining, it's like, 40 outside which is like a heat wave in Iowa um so I want to enjoy that while I can and then I'm going to come back and make some banana bread I think for a little valentine's day recipe and then I don't know we'll go from there but I want to do all that it's like still bright out so the lighting's good um so I'm going to go on the walk now and get back at like four and then it'll be like golden hour and go to sunset it's going to be so good but here is the chicken um yeah, looks. I wish I could have like cooked it on my pan, but I had my eggs going. I just wanted to throw it in there because it was easier, but yum, huh? I just got back from like the most beautiful walk outside. It was so nice. I think I walked like two, two and a half miles. Took some pictures because it was like so nice and there's like a sunny spot. So I'm like, oh, okay. So I literally stopped and it was so funny. I propped my, there was like a, the edge of like a parking ramp. Um, I put my coat to like hold up my, like I leaned my phone against my coat, hoping it didn't fall. And it didn't, and it worked. But there was definitely people like driving by seeing me do it, and it was a little embarrassing. But I'm like, we gotta do it for the grip, we gotta do it for the grip. But now I'm making my chocolate covered strawberry banana bread for TikTok, and I'm so excited.
The fact that that's still recording, um, BRB, why I just eat some of this <laughs> batter. I think the reason I like baking so much is because I like eating. Huh. Anyway, Kenji is a freaking disaster, so I'm gonna put all this away and clean it up. Because it's baked for 50 minutes. But based on the batter, this is gonna be fire. Like, so fire. All right, I just got my entire kitchen cleaned up. I feel amazing. It's all sparkly and clean. Everything's like cleaning and drying in the dishwasher. Um, but now I need to go take out my trash because it's piled up fast day. And since it's like warmer and the sun's still out, I'm gonna go do that now um, while that bakes. And then I'm gonna edit some photos while that bakes. You know, we're being efficient. Um, and then yeah, we'll finish the TikTok and post it. And I'm so excited. This honestly, I think it's gonna be so good. I'm so excited. But it literally is 26 more minutes. Oh, I feel so like on top of things and relieved. Like trash put away or taken out, baking, kitchens cleaned. Oh, I got a lot of stuff done today. I'm so happy. So I'm gonna sit and edit. It's five o'clock. Um, oh, today was such a good day, honestly. Let me just sit you down. Like content days are definitely my favorite just because I love like creating content and like doing it um, more so than obviously editing, um, but that's part of it. And so tomorrow will be more of an editing day, but honestly, I kind of got a lot of it edited today as well a lot of it you have to send in for like approval and stuff so i do need to do that but <gasps> my one of my rules of thumb for like honestly this goes for like work or chores if it's something that I take less if it's something that can take less than like five or ten minutes i do it right when i'm thinking of it if it's something that's like longer then i like i accept the fact that i might have to put it off but if it's something like taking out the trash it's gonna take less than five minutes i just do and get it over with because it's like such a weight off my shoulders and relief and you feel so much better so keep that in mind if you've never done that i heard that somewhere one time and i was like that's a good rule of thumb to follow so i do that and even like five minutes of cleaning like if i don't have an hour to clean my whole apartment i just do like five minutes wipe everything down and it just makes it feel so much better and cleaner and and you guys it's 5 15 and it's so bright out this is so amazing like spring is coming it makes me so happy like oh today was like such a 10 out of 10 day i'm loving it and honestly my hot girl walk was amazing oh, i didn't tell you guys I got my pickle subscription in the mail i have to show you but my hot girl walk was so amazing and i'm really excited to look at the pics but oh my god i can't believe i didn't show you guys my pickle subscription how could i forget i made like a tiktok about it reviewing it right when i got back from my walk i checked my mail room when i got back and it was there but Ow. Every month they get two different jars of pickles. So I got Roots Kitchen and Cannery Dill Pickle Spears. 9 out of 10. Those were so good. They weren't too sour, which I like. And then I got these Aska's Aliski. I don't know. Some amazing pickles. They're Miss Montaneous Sweet Hot Garlic with Roasted Pepper Pickles. They have like turmeric in them and had too much turmeric. And I feel like it was sweet with something weird. Um, so I got I give these like a seven seven and a half, but these were fire and I honestly had high expectations for these and not these and it switched But I'm excited every month to kind of like have fun and try some pickles. Okay guys, my banana bread's done I did eat some of it and started taking pictures of it, but I feel like it needed longer in the oven So I put it back in But like, oh My god Like I probably have chocolate on my face Like me standing. This is how I take photos of my food if you're wondering behind the scenes ring light because it's dark out we have no more natural light and then i stand up high and i like the white background parchment paper obviously is helpful for like cleaning but it also makes the aesthetic look prettier because it's white and then i put my hot pads under there so i don't ruin my table but like <laughs> you're I'm literally kidding this is the most i know you're, you guys are probably gonna hate this word moist but it literally is like let me just get a fork like look at this be so for real <laughs> Oh my dear, like, yeah. No, I'm like good. Like this might be my best recipe. So I'm just gonna let y'all know. I'll link it below for you because you need to go make it ASAP. I literally made a TikTok asking how not to eat like with the whole pan because I genuinely don't know how I'm gonna refrain. Um, it's healthy ingredients, you guys. There's nothing processed in this, nothing. There's coconut sugar and honey. Bananas, almond flour, oatmeal. 
hot. The like moisture in strawberries, because it's like a liquidy fruit, makes it like so moist. Also for my lip flip, I can't like lick off the top of a fork. Like I've literally eaten so much of this already. Just like, are you kidding? You see that? I know you see that shine. Amazing. It's literally amazing. You guys, my apartment smells like chocolate banana bread. It smells so good. Um, but I'm going to lay here and I actually have to put in my order for Define this month. And I'm really excited because if you saw my last vlog, well, it's been a while actually, probably since you see this one. But um, the one I just recently uploaded, time now, doesn't mean, whatever. <laughs> um, I am obsessed with their new dynamic pieces. So I'm really, really excited because... It's the stuff is so good. So I'm gonna order my month's order and I'm so excited because I literally want every single color and everything. And it's all just so good. I really, really, really want the pink sports bra. So I'm gonna see what they got. Hopefully it's not all sold out. We'll see. But <laughs> really what I'm doing right now is shopping. And I'm letting my banana bread cool. I'm gonna post the recipe and then I'm gonna make dinner and I'm gonna read before bed tonight. I think I'm gonna turn on a show now just to like have something playing that I'm gonna read because I didn't read this morning because I went to like my workout and I didn't walk on the stairs. So usually I read like 20, 30 minutes a day. I haven't read any today, so I'm gonna do that. Okay, I just made dinner. It's kind of like a little chicken parmesan. I have three of those chicken tenderloins, a ton of cottage cheese and some tomato sauce. And yeah, I'm not super hungry, honestly. Like really not hungry at much at all. Um, because I ate, I'll just show you, I ate a lot of banana bread. I did eat about a third of the loaf of banana bread, so I'm not starving, but I want to get some protein in and just like eat a dinner because I know I'll be hungry later, but it's 7.30 maybe? No, it's 8, almost 8 o'clock, so I'm going to eat this and then wind down and get ready for bed and start reading.